Hi there guys, how you doing? This is me, ChimpanzaThat45, and I'm back today with the next instalment on my FIFA 13 Seasons Mode series, and after yesterday's catastrophic failure, I decided to uh, stick with my guns and play as the beloved Arsenal. And uh, we go into our first game, we play Chelsea at home. Now in this episode, what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you four games, the final four games of the season, and we'll see if I can get promoted into Division 7, which hopefully I can. And you can see that we start really well against Chelsea, Olivier Giroud with a great headed goal. And we have plenty, and I mean plenty of chances. Podolski there with a tremendous opportunity, but he squandered it wide. Now I will be uploading another career mode episode, hopefully tonight, if not then definitely tomorrow. And I've got my next Formula 1 race on the PSORC uh, Racing League tonight. And look at that. Hit the post once, hit the post twice, check then, somehow saves it. But Wilshire bundles it in in the end. And we are 2-0 up after 30 odd minutes. And it's, it, it was a really good start, I see. We started really well. We were on top and we could have made it 3 there. But nonetheless, we go into half time, 2-0 up, feeling really good. And that's how the game finished. There was not a single highlight in the second half, so apologies about that. We move on now to our second game, where we have Liverpool again at home, just like on Wednesday night. And what about this? Look at this. Right from the start, this is just sped up. And there you see Stuart down and picks it up on the edge of the box, cuts inside, and what a terrible start. That was really shocking, and I was thinking, oh my god, this is going to be terrible. And I was genuinely worried that I was going to lose. And at this point, Brad Jones just kept pulling save after save out of the bag. There was one from Giroud there, one from Walker. Another tremendous save. I have no idea how he did it. We were squandering chances left, right and centre. But then Santa Cathola picks the ball up, runs, runs, runs. And that's a fabulous finish, isn't it, into the top corner. And that gets us back on equal terms. And so at this point I was thinking, oh, well, that's all right then, we'll settle down. And we get the ball back, we knock it around. We try playing it to Walcott, who loses it. And then, all of a sudden, you've got Henderson breaking down the left. And then what about this? Unbelievable. Unbelievable. I could not believe it. I'd thrown away that level level term that I had, and we were suddenly behind again. And then we get a stroke of fortune, because somehow the ref gives that as a penalty. I've no idea how he could give that as a penalty. And Lucas Podolski steps up. And he misses. It was an awful penalty. It was saved by the keeper. And that's half time. So we move on to the second half. And in this second half, I started much brighter. You can see there, Theo Walcott fires us on level terms. And I was feeling much better. And then a bit of confusion. And then we got Walcott in on goal again. And he's taken out by Brad Jones. Definite penalty. I must admit, I was worried at one point that the... Uh, sort of the impact engine wouldn't necessarily register that as a penalty because I have had cases like that before where that has happened and the ref has just told him to get up and given nothing which has been extremely disappointing but you can see Podolski puts us in front Giroud has a chance but uh, nevertheless we uh, are edging towards uh, a close a close fought victory until Daniel Sturridge only goes and scores after 90 minutes and we have no chance to put the ball in the back of the net and so it all comes down to our final two games we need to pick up a win to be promoted and we go into our next game against Portugal and we go a goal down after seven minutes but then seven minutes later we have Oxlade Chamberlain cutting inside and firing it into the top corner of the net with a beautiful finish I, I must admit I do question how to play with Arsenal online who should I play with up front because I played Giroud and he's decent you can see there we go 2-1 down but I played Podolski up the middle in the, uh, the Portugal game and he was okay, but Walcott up the middle was good as well. But Oxlade Chamberlain was absolutely superb. You can see there, talking of Walcott and Podolski, great control. That was actually the three of them. Oxlade Chamberlain with that lovely pass to Walcott who controlled it, played it to Podolski who tucked it away. Ronaldo going close with a free kick. But Walcott is tremendous. Look at his pace here. And he puts it wide and... Oh, wow. That's why Arsenal fans don't trust Jovino, because he misses chances like that. But then a, a minute later, and he scores that with a brilliant finish. And that was so frustrating. And we get back onto level pegging again, and we're looking to go for a draw. But then they score. 90 minutes, they score. We lose 3-4. 4-3. <laughs> Four, but it rhymed. So it all comes down to this, our last game. Last game of the season. Will we be able 
to play in Division 7 next season. Will we get promoted? Well, we're playing against Juventus. And we have Oxlade Chamberlain, who has a shot and it's uh, saved, but Podolski tucks it away. And I must admit, I was glad to get that early goal because it's so important to get an early goal in a game just because it gives you so much confidence and uh, it gives you a bit of a foothold for the rest of the game. And you can see there, that throw in took forever because our opponent, well, he, he left for some reason. So you can see Oxley chamberlain Walcott, Cthulhu, Oxley chamberlain four goals, 5-0, 53 minutes. Then all of a sudden he comes back. But to be honest, at that point, the game was pretty much over anyway. 61 minutes is a bit of, it's, uh, a bit of an anticlimax because Shelney got sent off in the end for a bad tackle from behind. But that is the result. We get promoted to Division 7. A great result. I'm pleased because I just want to get as high as I can, as quick as I can. You know that. I know that. So we're moving up, moving on up, and we're into Division 7. I'll be back hopefully tonight with another career mode episode. But uh, until then, we're into Division 7. I'm Chim Paz that 45. Like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on Twitter at Arsenal 49. And thanks a lot for watching. Goodbye.